Elias International Schools had her 11th biennial inter-house sports competition at the Command Secondary School, Ipaja. It was a fun-filled day for the students and parents of Elias International School. The students and pupils, both in Alimosho campus and Okyodo campus, as well as parents and members of staff and management, were all fully present and had a lot of fun. The event began with an opening prayer, which was led by Temi Tokwe Akinshiku, followed by the national and school anthem. There shall not be calamities, tragedy, or any kind in the mighty name of Jesus. And at the end of today, let us have the cause to give thanks to the Almighty God. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Then, the parade was taken by all the houses, which was beautiful. Special greetings from Yellow House. See the light at the end of the tunnel. And I can feel heaven in this place. They are saying, I mean, and that is are welcome. Yeah. They are saying, that's a sign of a victory. I'm from daddy and mommy from right Red House in. now. They are happy that you are here. Mommy and Daddy, you are welcome. Now I can see the distance of your journey. The school administrator, Dr. Mrs. Olua Kemi Olua Gunos, stood for her welcome address. This is the 11th biennial in transport of Inaz International School. We've been doing it this way for 11 years. This is our 11th. Every two, two years, thank you for clapping. The Lord bless you. Every two, two years, we do this. It's a great event on our calendar. It's part of the curriculum of education. As a school, we don't shy away from responsibility of ensuring that our children partake in everything they want to experience in education. And our children have been practicing. Today you are going to see a lot of them showing forth their skills. Invited schools on ground, we appreciate your coming. We realize that it's a sacrifice for you to come. This is because many schools are tensed now for sports activity and also with the fact that the nation that is going home that to make people to shy away from moving out of their comfort zone but thank you for honoring our invitation followed by the chairman's speech taken by dr sholak witton this has been a very glorious day uh, a great great school a great citadel of learning um it, it it's a school that we can all relate with and because we have all identified with the standard that um, a layer school has set that's why we have been bold enough to bring our children uh, to the school and we thank all the teachers the school administrators for what they have they have been doing and how they are building the leaders of tomorrow as we all know physical activity is an essential element of a healthy living being and so I am very happy that the management of the last school has organized this inter-house sport to encourage our young leaders to make physical activity a part of their daily lives. Then was the lighting of the torch of unity and the event was declared open. In the name of 
the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you so much. At the Elias International School's 11th Biennial Interhouse Sports Competition, the oath taken paved the way for part of the main event of the day, which included the match past as it commenced by the school's Red Cross, the nursery parade, and the different houses from both Okeodo Campus and the Alimosha Campus. The houses were Sapphire House, Emerald House, Jasper House, and Chrysolite House. All the houses performed beautifully. I, Adejoe, Taiwo Mary, promise that we will officiate in the inter-Oxford competition of Elian International School, respecting and observing all the rules and regulations governing the competition in the spirit of sportsmanship. So help us God.
my school is very, very creative. They are holy, godly. They teach us a lot of morals, values, you know. Skills International School is a very wonderful school. They teach us morals, many godly things. They make sure we don't go astray. If they see any students like going wayward, they expel if necessary. And also, they make sure that we are very disciplined. Like, the school is very, very disciplined. They make sure all students are like following the rules accordingly. The school is organized and they teach good morals and they teach well. The teachers are good. Very good school. They have good morals and they have good teachers who and they have also have good students who are ready to teach students on how they behave and other and all things. I like my school because it's intelligent, creativity and excellence. School it's amazing. They are teaching moral and spiritual aspect and not only that with the physical aspect. The school tries their best to balance academics and um, extracurricular activities together. Even though they're more on the academics, but they don't like deny the extracurricular aspect, as you can see. So wherever you see the blue lights, you know. International Schools Interhouse Sports Competition continued with the orchestra presentation, which was quite brilliant. The chairman of LS International School was celebrated with a song on his birthday. The track event commenced with 800 meters race boys and girls, 200 meters race boys and girls, sack race junior boys and girls, tug of war junior and senior boys and girls, 100 meters intermediate boys and girls, 100 meters boys and girls, banana race boys and girls, busting the balloon boys and girls, lime and spoon race boys and girls, journey of the brave. Ribena race, sleepers race, boys and girls, picking the ball, filling the bottle, 200 meters intermediate race, boys and girls, relay race, boys and girls, 4 by 100 meters race, boys and girls.
Old students were not left out of the race, members of staff were not left out of the race, and the esteemed parents of LS International School also took to the tracks to be part of the fun race. Wonderful. It's a great school. Great to tell and just the best. The school is a good school. They give students the opportunity to participate in all areas, both academically and physically, both academically and um, um, sports-wise. So it's at least helping the children, helping the children and developing their mental, which we really like about the school, because it gives students opportunity in all areas of. The school is a unique school of excellence. The citadel of learning. The school imbibing the students' moral and um, Christian values they ensure the students imbibe values that can make them responsible citizens in the society. At Elias International Schools, there was presentation of awards of recognition to the dignitaries and a complimentary money plank was also presented to the management of Elias International School. The morals they are giving to the children is is, a, is 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 very superb. I have four here, and they all started from scratch. And I even advise some people. I introduce people, friends that I know, to come to the school. In fact, God is really doing a great job here. Elias is innovative. They are brilliant and they are good. And I want to also appreciate the fact that despite what is going on currently, every parent is here enjoying themselves. This is a great event. Um, this is even unique for uh, Elias International. And we see all the uh, events, uh, the activities that the children have done. I think every school should continue to do this um, uh, physical activities and sports because you will always need it every day of life. I want to thank God for the success of the program. One of the reasons why entire sport is being done in so many schools is for the student to enjoy what we call the psychomotor domain of education. And I think it is necessary for schools to do this program on a regular basis. There are spiritual aspects. They are very, very spiritual. And the morals given to the students, I love that. They are good ambassadors. I can, all I can say about earlier is that they produce a, a well-breed um, ambassadors for the future of our country. Everything about the layers is it's been good so far. Since my kid joined, I have seen the improvements academically, uh, morally, and the I like the special care the teachers take in the students. I congratulate I congratulate all of them. May the Lord spare their life, give them long life, good health, those both students and parents and teachers and everybody in the name of Jesus. I mean, I've known Elias International Schools to have high standards when it has to do with academics and, you know, morals. So having this kind of sport event to bring a balance to that, I think it's amazing. It's a laudable one. The children have been doing it well. Uh, I'm excited because their performance is great. I can see them running with power and hell all. And apart from that, I, I'm so grateful to God because God has em empowered these children to be able to do a lot of physical games, physical activities. So it's a win-win. We stand for integrity, discipline. We stand for creativity, and we stand for spirituality. Knowing fully well that my students they are the butter. Majority of them, they are not being exposed to this kind of exercise. But when it comes to inter sport, you see them putting all their best in what they are doing. And to God's the glory, they are doing wonderfully well. And I'm dazed with the results I'm seeing concerning their performance. 
They are, they are like family. They gather people a lot. They encourage people. They motivate people. I don't know what to say about Haile. They are all sorts. The 11th Biennial Interhouse Sports Competition rounded off with presentation of medals, gifts, and trophy. All stand for the winning house. Elias International Schools with godly values for great success.